Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna be talking about some of my current favorites and the things that I have been using on a regular daily basis. And if you guys hear any weird noises, I'm sorry. But my kids are here and they're not getting babysat today. But we're about to get started on that. And when we get started, hopefully we won't have a bunch of random interruptions. So anyways, so let's go ahead and start talking about my favorites and we'll jump right into the video. Okay, so first things first, I wanted to talk about Bondi Sands. This is the self-tanner I've been using for a while and I love the color for this. The color payoff is great. I feel like for me it fades really well on my skin. I don't really usually get very patchy. Um, I only deal with like scaling because I have really dry skin and I don't moisturize, but if you're moisturizing, it's beautiful and I'm just lazy a little bit. But I use the color dark and honestly, I love this stuff. So if you guys are looking for a tanner to try, this one's great. I will say though, um, the color that comes off from your tan is kind of a pinky salmon color, so be careful if you're not wanting to stain your sheets. So, the next thing I wanted to talk about is this perfume I've been using. It's called um, Midnight Petals, and it's from Victoria's Secret. And I love this scent so much. It's got, it's kind of a mixture of like a vanilla florally smell, which I really like. It's not super heavy. It just smells really nice on your skin throughout the day. It doesn't smell overwhelming, which I really like, but it smells really nice. And I get compliments on the way I smell. So. That's the Midnight Petals. I don't know if you can see that. Right. Anyway, the next thing I wanted to talk about is Rejuvenique Oil from Monet. I have really been enjoying this. I've been using it for so many different uses. I've used it for like a lip, like a chapstick moisturizer for my lips before bed. I've been using it as a moisturizer for my skin. I've done oil treatments for my scalp. I've been using it as kind of like a finisher for my hair when I finish blow drying it and just I like to rub an oil through my hair but I really really have been liking this one it has been so nice and it absorbs in instead of kind of feeling like left on your hair so my hair isn't left looking greasy or oily so yeah I've been loving this okay so for the next thing I wanted to talk about is two of my favorite lipstick color combos and I'm actually wearing this on my lips right now but it's NYX lingerie I really like I'm just I really can't seem to branch out. I am pretty much always a nudes kind of girl. I'd like to wear like nude colors on my lips. So this one is um, Bedtime Flirt. And then this one is Corset. And I love these two. I love them together and I love them separately. This one, the Corset color is more of a brownish tone and then the Bedtime Flirt is more of like a rosy reddish pink tone, which is really nice for the fall. really like this one. But put together, creates just a really nice, not like neutral lip color that has a little bit of color, but also not too light and not too dark. The next thing I wanted to talk about that's on my favorites is this Matte Velvet Skin uh, Powder from Makeup Forever. This has been such a lifesaver. I don't wear this every single day, um, but... When I'm just on the go and needing to put something on, I've been just using this. I'll just get the powder and I'll like put it right under my eyes for just a little bit of coverage or just all over my face. And honestly, it has been coming into handy so well for me. Um, I use the color Y245. So this has been, this has been awesome. And if you're a mom and, or even if you have to get up super early in the morning for work or whatever it is on the go, this is great for that. This is buildable and has great coverage if you want to build up coverage or if you want just more of a like a light coverage, this is great for that. So I know I said this is kind of random, but I have been loving taking baths. Like, oh my gosh, I love taking baths so much right now. I have been taking a bath pretty much at least three times a week. So I have been using this Dr. Teal's Pink Himalayan Mineral Soak. The scent is, oh, it smells so good. It's kind of like a orangey, like orangey bergamot smell is what it says. Anyways, I have been loving this one. I've been working out and I've noticed actually like my, I feel less sore 
and it smells lovely and it's just been so nice. So I've been using this a lot and I highly recommend it. It's the Restore and Replenish and I just can't get enough of it. Bath times have been a necessity in this house with dealing with the two kids during the day and then just being kind of ready to calm down in the evening. It's been part of my nightly routine and I just love it. So I wanted to share that with you guys because this smells great and it feels great and I've been loving my baths. So. Okay, so for my next thing I wanted to talk about and share with you guys is this necklace. I have been loving this necklace. It's super simple. Okay, so this necklace has been like my go-to. I love how it sits on me. I'll just show you really quickly. So I've been wearing this a lot lately and I just, one, I love the color. It's like a nice little pop of color because usually I wear mostly like neutral, gold, black, those kinds of tones. So it's been really nice to have just like a little pop of color. And I got this from Banks Jewelry. If you guys are interested, you can check it out. But yeah, I've been loving this necklace and just having a nice little pendant and it just looks really nice. So yeah, last but not least, um, this is a lot pricier of an item, but I wanted to share it anyways because it has been one of my most used use favorite items right now. I got it for my birthday, but they're AirPods. And honest to goodness, you guys, these AirPods have been just so helpful. And I have been able to put them in, not have any cords hanging down or anything like that, and just walk around my house listening to podcasts, Audible, um, just listening to things, talking on the phone, whatever, while I'm still able to get all my mom things done. So I'm able to work around the house, get things clean, take care of my kids without worrying about, you know, these cords getting in the way or even like getting dressed. I can easily get them off and have my AirPods in. Anyways, if you guys have the ability to invest in some AirPods, these have been awesome. So anyways, AirPods have been my faves. Okay. So that is it for my current faves. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that you guys got some ideas of some items maybe you want to try. If you liked it, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and comment below what you guys are currently loving right now. I'd love to hear about it. Anyways, hope you guys have a wonderful day and a wonderful week, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.